Sammy Kay kicks it back out to Amber Dean. Amber Dean goes baseline for two. Nice finish by Dean, or of the drive here by Dean. You see the late rotation defensively by Richmond. That can't happen. Now Kelly, Austria underneath. Had that side wide open. Filmy. And again, in and out for Richmond. Well, they're getting their opportunities in the paint which is a good sign. Those shots are gonna fall for them. Olivia Applewhite fires for three. The senior cannot get that one to fall. Dayton, quick underneath Kelly Austria. And they were looking for a charge there. That was Christina King who will be called for the foul. She was trying to get her feet set, just couldn't do it. And watch the tempo is quick here for Dayton. And King clearly not set in a defensive position. She, she's going to make it work somehow. And she's been able to do a fantastic job on both teams. Player of the year in the A-10 on the soccer team for the past two years. Olivia Applewhite muscled it in, draws the foul, fired up. Applewhite, her upper body strength is so supreme inside. She demands the ball right here. Watch her footwork. She's going to spin tight and get the shot to go. And arriving on the catch, making it very difficult for Dayton to get clean looks. Here Dayton, again, shot clock under 10. Hoover, behind the back, back outside to Applewhite. Fires for three and good. My goodness. Applewhite having a better day, 14 points for the senior. Wanted to do from the beginning of the game and weren't able to do it because Richmond disallowed a lot of things. But this second half has been all Dayton in terms of their personality, which is run and score. Applewhite, turn around. Got it. Well, you have to be smart and maintain your body, especially down the stretch here for Richmond. Pretty move underneath by Andrea Hoover. And the ball thrown away, and Coach Jaber a little upset here with his squad. Oh, it's just a little sloppy play. Coach Jaber knows they don't have a, a chance if they make little mistakes, but Hoover with the up and under off the glass. Ball sent forward to Ali Malat, who was all alone underneath, and the timeout by Coach Schaefer. Dayton extending their lead here, 61-48, doing no wrong here in this period of the second half. Here in the final seconds. And Andrea Hoover will just hold the ball here and wrap this one up for Dayton. The 17th ranked Flyers with the win here, 71-64. Final thoughts. Final thoughts are, I think that Richmond played a tough game even though they didn't score enough points today, had a couple lulls, but their effort and intensity on defense will carry them a long way as the season continues. And Dayton did a tremendous job of keeping their undefeated conference record intact. So Dayton improves to 7-0 in conference play, 19-1 on the season. The Spiders fall to 12-11, 2-5 in conference play. Once again, our final score, Dayton on top of Richmond, 71-64.